And new tonight, three dogs believed to be abandoned in an apartment in Balcones Heights. A lot of people want to help. You may have seen some of their messages on Facebook, but as the night team's Lee Waldman reports, rescuing those dogs, that's not so easy. It was just out of character to see them that distressed those many days in a row. This neighbor didn't want to show her face out of fear of retaliation, but she did share her video of three dogs believed to have been abandoned at the Coral Gables apartments in Balcones Heights. Each minute is going by, these animals are scared, they're lonely, they're in the dark. She says the animals were alone in an apartment for a week. She messaged management and got this back in response. We cannot do anything with abandoned dogs or enter his unit without permission. Not comfortable. Lindsay Haynes is the president of the property management company that oversees the apartment. And we have some very specific restrictions on how we can remove pets. Our lease says that we have to give a 24 hour notice. Haynes said the situation was brought to her attention Sunday and to her knowledge, it had been a shorter period of time. The dogs were alone. Regardless, her property manager made calls to animal control and police. The police department and animal control were still steadfast that they could not get involved until there was a eviction and a writ of possession. Haynes says it wasn't until the story was shared hundreds of times on social media that Balcones Heights officials got involved and the dogs were removed. Too many pieces. Lorenzo Nastasi with the city says it's not as simple as going in to rescue the dogs. You have a process of notifications and things like that. It's complicated by the fact that this is private property. He says the dogs are safe and appear to be healthy, and the city is currently working on what to do next. Adhering to the different processes and legalities that have to be done in any situation with regarding property, because animals, dogs are property. Again, those dogs are safe, but city officials have not told us where they're being held. As of tonight, no charges of animal cruelty have been filed against the owner of those dogs. I'm told that an investigation needs to be done before anything like that can happen. Haynes says they'll go ahead and proceed with either an official eviction notice or a notice of abandoned property for the apartment's tenant. Live in Balcones Heights, Lee Waldman, KSAT 12 News.